So this is why I like being an author. And I can't picture my life ever not writing books. I hope to be write, writing books the rest of my life. Because of moments like today. I had a customer come in that ordered my very first book. We're talking like the very first like number one of 45 and she she's an older lady probably in her 80s and she told me that the book was quite good um she just started reading it and i had done a page or a you know a note in the book about having too much um for example i use scarves and um music and clothes and how even though I'm not defined by them, I just find myself having too many. Because every now and then I'll come across something I had bought six months ago. Or a CD that I bought six months ago and still in the wrapper or still has a price tag. And, you know, you can only wear so many clothes. You can only wear so many um, scarves. You can only listen to music so many, you know, a CD so many times before you get bored. And my main message in it was that excess... And having a lot to fulfill a void in a hole of something that's missing in your life. So I had thanked her and I had said that I was glad that she liked it. And, you know, I made the silly comment that I can't, at, good, at least I know I'm not the only one. And she said that my message was universal. And that really resonated with me because that's the point of my books is to be universal and show that we are all one. We all have similar um, fears and strengths and in the end we are all one universal so it just keeps cementing um me as an author it shows that even though the church won't let me be a pastor because of my sexuality that through the books I'm reaching strangers and I had a nice conversation for like five or ten minutes with a stranger and it was awesome. So I thank God for letting me be an author. I hope you will check out one of my books. Because I know there's something in there that we can unite and realize that we are one. Even if we are perfect strangers or never ever meet or talk. But we know that somewhere out in the world somebody feels like you feel. Somebody feels like I feel. It's universal, baby.